Okay, so we had problem number two, which is write three eighths and five sixths with common denominators in three different ways. So we found the least common denominator between eight and six was gonna be 24. So we multiplied each by this one by three and this one by four to get nine out of 24 and 20 out of 24. And then from each multiplying number from there, we doubled it. So this next one we multiplied by 6 to get the common denominator of 48. And we multiplied this one by 8 to get the common denominator of 48. Why do you have to double to 3 to 6? Yeah. We just figured that would be the easiest way to make sure both numbers go into our common denominator. Um, so then we did it again to get 96 as our common denominator. Multiply this one by 12 to get 36 over 96, and this one by 16 to get